to all of you. I would like to welcome you all in our afternoon session every Saturday at 12 o'clock, where we talk a lot about news, views, discussion, how is the market behaving, so anything and everything about real estate. Uh, I also try to uh, bring a lot of uh, information uh, about SafeMax, that how we are growing our business all across the country and not only all across the country but I would say in other countries as well and uh, we always seek your uh, suggestions guidance your feedback uh, about uh, uh, the way we are conducting our business the way we are trying to um, put ourselves forward in the community uh, as well because this is very very important uh, I always believed uh, we should definitely do some good charity in our life. Mm, I was talking to somebody about uh, the concept of uh, the swanth, right? Which is uh, uh, very popular in, in the Sikh in the Sikh community, and I personally like like those kind of concepts. Uh, it is very very important for us to do something good, something related to charity in our life. Everybody have their own way of doing charity. Uh, I learned it somewhere from uh, one of my business partner that charity can be done in different ways. Sometimes you can feed hungry people. Sometimes you can contribute in somebody's education. Uh, Sometimes you can help underprivileged kids uh, to put their energy into the positive direction. Uh, I personally feel the biggest charity in the world is giving a job to somebody because if you create a job for somebody, that person impact almost 50 lives in his surroundings, in his or her surroundings. So if you are creating job for one person, it directly or indirectly makes an impact on 50 lives in his or her surrounding. So you are spreading the good deeds to other people in the surrounding as well. I always had an aspiration to become the biggest employer in this country and I will keep putting my efforts to make sure I attain my goal of becoming the biggest employer in Canada. I'll tell you a background story about it. Um, so when I came into this country uh, of course there's a lot many people who helped me somebody helped me to get a job as a security guard Somebody helped me to get a job at a gas station. I always thought of saying thanks to them because they helped me to come forward and make my living in this country. Then after that, uh, I actually worked in an immigration company as well. Uh, and then I started my real estate career. So I always had a thought process that I am going to help as many people as I can to get a job in this country. Uh, even at my office, we always encourage new immigrants to come and get experience because you all know in Canada, the biggest challenge to a new immigrant comes when, when they land here in this country, uh, whenever they are going for an interview, the first question they have been asked, do you have any Canadian experience? Unfortunately, they don't. So I always thought who is going to give chance to new immigrant to get a job? And I really made a pledge to myself at that time that to the best of my capabilities, I will try my level best to create as many jobs as I can in this country. And especially I will help a lot of new immigrants so that at least whenever they are looking for some other job, they don't have to say that they don't have a Canadian experience. And I proudly say that um, I would say uh, 80 to 90 percent people working in SaveMax are or were new immigrants one day and majority of them. It was their first job. So we are going to have a lot of discussion about real estate as well. Uh, we have uh, will be. Uh, having Kamal with us as well as Sachin 
So let me let me just take both of them first so that we can make this uh, discussion a little interesting. Kamal, good afternoon. How are you? I'm good, Raman. How are you? Very fantastic, Kamal. How's it going? Everything doing good. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. You're looking very bright today. Well, what is the secret behind it? <laughs> oh, nothing, nothing like that. And the day, every day, I look uh, some positivity in the day going forward. I I was meeting a couple of uh, entrepreneurs in the morning, and uh, I feel so happy. You know, the young guys, like say 25, 28, 30, you know, and they are looking to expand their horizon. You know, and they are looking to get into the business side of the thing. So that gives me a lot of energy. You know, so yeah. Mm -mm. That's good, Kamal. And I think uh, uh, this is what entrepreneurship is all about. Um, I think uh, uh, there's no age for entrepreneurship. Am I right? Yeah, of course. Of course. Uh, Sometimes I have seen people having a kind of uh, a misimpression in their mind that let me get some experience in some corporate world and then I will become an entrepreneur and all this. But I personally believe like, you know, sometimes entrepreneurship is already flowing in our blood. Right, but it, it gets stuck up somewhere. You know, that bug does not get a chance to explore himself. So this is what we are doing. We are putting a catalyst in people's brain to awake that entrepreneurial bug. And I absolutely understand, Kamal, it is not going to be an easy journey because the biggest challenge in the world is to motivate and encourage people to realize their own potential. <laughs> I agree. I agree. Right? Yeah. Most of the time, people are so much comfortable in their comfort zone and they hate the person who bring them out of the comfort zone. So, right? Yeah. You, you remember like, you know, back home in India when it was a winter season and uh, let's say if your mom and dad, they come and take off your blanket. Of course. Right? Because they were taking you out of your comfort out zone. Right? Comfort zone. Yeah. <laughs> So you can you can stay in your blanket and feel cozy and be in your comfort zone. But I think the good idea is sometimes you have to take off your blanket and come out of your comfort zone and tell yourself that, you know what, this is what I'm going to do. That's so true. Yeah. Okay. So come on. Why don't we take Sachin with us as well? I think we all are making a good combination and having a good discussion, isn't it? Oh, yes. <laughs> I, I always... Uh... You know, learn from uh, both the stalwarts, you know, <laughs> and learn from you and Sachin in every discussion. Yeah. And Kamal, I want to say thanks to all those people who are joining. I can see uh, Trilok. Uh, uh, I can see uh, Kevin over there. Um, thank you. Thank you very much, guys, for putting your messages. Uh, and actually, uh, Trilok is uh, a regular viewer of our show. And oh, he's appreciating what a great, great example of winter blanket. Uh, yes, uh, to look and I uh, sometimes I just try to pick up the examples from our real life uh, to correlate it with with the corporate life, to correlate it with people's, uh, uh, I would say, how they can be successful. Uh, that is what I always believed in my life. People understand the examples from the common life much easier and try to correlate it with their own personal growth and their own personal life. Anyway, uh, thank you very much, uh, Kevin, for joining us. Uh, let's bring on board uh, Sachin as well. Sachin, very good morning. How are you? Good morning, Raman. Good morning, Kamal. You both seems to be so fresh. What's the secret behind it? <laughs> Just finished a franchisee meeting with one of the potent the franchises, and you know he's very excited, waiting for the decision to happen at Rico. So you know we are just doing some hiring for him. Oh, perfect, perfect, excellent. Yes. Um, so uh, <laughs> Tilok is saying, I foresee myself as the fourth person on the video call. Uh, Tilok, you know what? Uh, let's do something uh, different, Kamal. Next week, we are, we are going to bring uh, Tilok with us. Sure. But, you know, why do we do next week? Why don't we do this week? Uh, Tilok, uh, I will give you my phone number and uh, uh, let's bring him on the, on the show today. Tilok, why don't you share your email and I'll send you the link to join in. Absolutely. That will be great. So Sachin, um, uh, send, uh, uh, Tilok, send an email on sachin.gupta at savemaxcorp.ca. Am I right, Sachin? Or you can share it right on the chat and I'll pick up from here. I can see the chat. Oh, perfect. So Tilok, share your email and Sachin is going to send you an invitation and 
come on board man let's uh, let's talk a little bit about uh, let's do some fun and you know i met a gentleman yesterday and uh, it's a really good i mean i feel so good and i always share these uh, small small uh, uh, discussion what i have uh, what i have with the with the different he is working with the, one of the different brokerages and uh, he is really happy there like i mean to be very honest he was like getting a lot of leads and this and that that company primarily uh, is into that you know so his uh, point of coming and meeting was like he could relate our talks with uh, something what he has been dreaming of saying that he never got that confidence before um, that he is an ordinary guy can he really do something then he said like i have been uh, listening to you guys from a long time and it gives me a confidence that you really guys can you know bring the common guy to do something extraordinary you know and that was the reason he was here yesterday and wanted to explore the opportunity maybe uh, starting his career uh, with us and uh, then growing uh, as an entrepreneur but the good part was like he was so open to learn you know and he was accepting the fact that yeah there is a good chunk of uh, um, uh, I, i would say masses uh, you know uh, which who wants to grow you know and they are ordinary people and we are giving them a chance to grow you know uh that's that's very interesting actually uh, kamal uh, sachin did you get the email from uh, from link already been sent to the lok oh fantastic so the lok you can uh, uh, use that link and you can join us as well uh, we will have some interesting discussion today uh, uh kamal you actually talked about uh, uh something which is very close to my heart i always see myself as a common man and yes we all are ordinary people uh, i always go and talk wherever uh, i get a chance i get an opportunity that we are not scientists we are not doctors we are not like uh, uh very high end it professionals savemax is a group of common people and ordinary people but we are doing something ordinary in an extraordinary way and what we are doing is that we are giving a new direction a new vision to all the ordinary people to all those people who never thought in their life to become more than a realtor because they have been taught they have been told that entrepreneurship doesn't belong to you and and i would strongly recommend if you don't trust on what i am saying try to go and talk to your brokerage try to go and see what response you get you will be discouraged am i right but the idea is there is nothing wrong to explore the opportunities in life yes there might be a way to do it but i am a firm believer that you should build a system it is not only that you can just build up a system through opening a brokerage there are other ways to do that am i right sachin that's right yeah. raman and you know that's what i was discussing with in my last meeting that was happening with a new realtor he is just you know going through his third exam and uh, when i explained him that from the day one he can work towards building a system and to build that system he doesn't need to open a brokerage we can do exactly the same thing that he might achieve by opening a brokerage by op- having all those expenses taking all those responsibilities all the that can be achieved without making any investment all that can be achieved without uh, taking any responsibility or liability but yes you got to work towards building a system that is very important i never say that you don't have to work for it definitely when we are working the building a system you got to work for it and it doesn't happen overnight it might take year it might take 3 years just like any other business to you know set up yeah and he was so excited that you know what really i can start building a team right from the day one when i got my license i said yes you can do it and you will have all the support from our safe save max platform you will you will have all the support to become a successful realtor a successful team lead and a successful entrepreneur going forward yes so sachin i think this is very very important and uh, uh see i can see you as an example i know uh when we were talking building up savemax and all that stuff 
you and me both used to talk a lot about these things yeah. and of course like you were not in the field at that time so you had so much so many uh, doubts and i still remember uh, when we were thinking of uh, uh, putting up a team under you uh, you always have that in mind ramon can i like do you think i'm ready for it and i was always like such and you know what let's do it no problem yeah. we'll learn with the time am i right yes that's right <laughs> And you know, again, uh, yesterday I was in one of the franchise orientation, and I was talking to one of the guy in Calgary. I think Kunal. Kunal. So he asked me that Sachin, you know what? During the journey, did you had the failures? Like what challenges you faced during the journey that you had in last five years? And I said, you know what? I had my own challenges. I we had our own failures. Okay, it's not that uh, the success was coming easy to us. Uh, there was challenges in building the team. There was challenges in building the enterprise and the the brokerages. But with time, with our failures, we learned, and we kept making ourselves better. Uh, but Sachin, I don't understand something. Um, I personally love failures. Like failures, like I don't consider that as a failure. Failure is not a failure. Failure is a way to learn. Yes. Right. Failure is a way to learn. So there is nothing. There is nothing uh, actually. Failure should not be a word in the dictionary. There should be a word which should, like you know, it's a learning. So I, if I if I say even if that word is there in the dictionary, the definition of that word should be the way you know how not to do the, the same thing. There you go. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. So now you know the way how not to do this. this. <laughs> Uh, Sachin, we are having a lot many people who are joining us. I can see Sanjeev over here, and Sanjeev is saying, "I have a, I'm one of those who was discouraged in the previous brokerage." Uh, but Sanjeev, now you are uh, uh, under a banner where actually, uh, you know, we are pushing you to go and become a leader. <laughs> <laughs> and believe me, Sanjeev, uh, personally, I tell you, uh, whenever I met you in my life, like you know, we met so many times in the field and all this stuff. And I always got a positive feeling from Sanjeev. I, I, I always got something like, you know what, Sanjeev, you can do it. And I think this is what is very, very important. And this is what the system we want to build up in the Save Max. That yeah. we want to encourage anybody and everybody, whosoever has even a little capability, that's what they think. Because Sachin, I personally believe every single individual have some good qualities. As a leader, it becomes our duty to ensure that we bring that person forward based on his strength and ignore his weaknesses. I never believed in working on anybody's weakness because otherwise you will keep wasting your energy just on making yourself better, right? Sometimes I enjoy my weaknesses personally, to be very frank. I enjoy a lot. <laughs> And Sachin, we have uh, uh, Kanika, she is joining us. She is a regular viewer from India. I, I was actually uh, doing a little chit chat with her and I saw she got uh, an award from one of the uh, golf uh, golf club or something. Uh, Kanika, I'm so sorry. I actually saw that and I would like to personally congratulate you and thank you very much. I know it's a little odd time in India and I see you are a regular viewer of the show. Um, I, I really appreciate you joining from India. Uh, so, uh, Kamal, what is going to be the topic of discussion today? Uh, zero investment and 100% uh, entrepreneurship. Is that <laughs> what I understand? I don't know. From where you you both of you guys bring all these ideas, like you know, <laughs> um, you you are making market like you know you are making people crazy, right? So again, Raman, this idea came to me when uh, I was talking to one of the franchises, you know, one of the potential franchises, and he was explaining to me that, you know what, I want to get to a next level. I want to become an entrepreneur. I want to build my team. But you know what? I'm afraid of making all these investments. I'm afraid to, you know, put in all this cost towards opening an office or, you know, um, doing the marketing and all this stuff. You know, I'm afraid of all these things. Then I thought, you know, if he has that apprehension you know he has a team of three or four people that apprehension or that concern could be with so many people in the in the market so many team leads or who are you know trying to build their team or they already have their team they want to get to the next level but somehow they they have these apprehensions or concerns that you know what should i make those these investments am i ready to make those investments and that's where 
they are they are holding them some self up they are i would say restraining themselves and not going to the next level so that's when this idea came to me that we should have some model for all those people who wants to start a business who wants to build a team but they don't want to make the investment so today's topic is all about building a team building entrepreneurship without making any investment or without taking any responsibility Huh. this is what all we're going to discuss today and that's the model that we are going to build on uh, sachin uh, i actually personally disagree with you right um, you are <laughs> kamal what do you what do you think about it sachin is telling like okay you don't take any responsibility and you become a leader is that right um no i, I would say that responsibility a lot lie on a leader and because see just take your example okay you have a responsibility to share your vision to bring everyone on the same platform okay and uh, ensure that uh, you know everyone is growing highly motivated so there is a bigger responsibility i would say as a leader which comes you know what i understand um, uh, mr sachin is saying here is like more towards the cost side of the things if i am not wrong Yes. Kamal, beside the cost thing, I'm also talking about the liability that comes with when you take a take a own start a business, because you know the kind of profession we are in. Obviously, when you become a leader, you start your brokerage, you become a broker record. It comes with a lot of responsibilities and liabilities, and those are the points which many I would say platform they discourage you on. You know what? If you become a broker record, you have to take the responsibility. If any realtor makes a makes a mistake, you are responsible to answerable to RICO. uh you will be responsible to answer to everything that realtor would do so those things they discourage those people to get to the next level and that's where we are trying to build a system wherein there is somebody to, to take those, those responsibilities so you focus on what you are best at which is sales and building team yes and i think that's what sachin means so sachin is not saying that you should actually forgo all over us all the responsibilities but and i think it's in a very good sense and sachin i appreciate uh, your wisdom all the times but before that i would like to uh, uh, read this comment from sanji for all the motivation and support now i am a proud save maxian and sachin believe me that gives me so much happiness yeah uh, from, and you know i i love these things from the depth of my heart when i see more and more people are joining hands with us and you know what this is this is something which is coming from the heart yes. this is something which is coming straight from the heart from sanjeev and sanjeev we really appreciate that you trusted on us and become a proud team mem i would say a family member a, a yes. same family this is what i always believed uh, that we have to build up such a wonderful culture such a wonderful work culture in our system that everybody should come and enjoy working over here and i feel proud when i see uh, our team members uh, i i would like to congratulate kamal uh, and i was so happy day before yesterday when i handed over a brand new mercedes keys to him and he himself is a success story 3 years in this country and reaching on to a position where he is a director of franchise operation you know driving that elegant car which is which was always my dream to drive that mercedes car kamal <laughs> Come on, you're driving my van, right? <laughs> All right, Sachin. So we have somebody else who is joining with us, and um, uh, I think uh, to look when to get ready. Ah, huh? he might. Yeah, that's what you know. He took five minutes to get ready. <laughs> <laughs> hi, Sachin. Hi, Raman. Hi, Kamal. Hi, Sachin. Hey, Tilo. How are you? It's such a pleasure talking to you guys live because I've always been on the other side of the video, always hearing what you guys have to say, and I'm so happy to be on air. I I really feel like a celebrity and a special person today. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, Raman. Thanks for thanks for being so prompt and you know like accepting my wish and uh, letting me be a part of the show today. Hey, Tilo. This is what life is all about, and I like those spontaneous things in my life. and the moment you put the remarks and i'm pretty sure you might be sitting in your pajamas and you went to get ready right <laughs> honestly i'm not going to stand up uh, today because i'm still in my pajamas <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank you so much guys thanks for all for making all me you. so uh, feel so special today oh that's that's always my pleasure and uh, 
I think, look, this is what I always believe in my life. And that's how I live my life. So I never planned for so many things. Like, you know, I always take my life the way it comes. Raman, I am so, so impressed by your thought process. And uh, same goes with Kamal and Sachin. Um, and, and to that promptness, I, I really want to share a story that, you know, I had from my childhood. Uh, so I would not say childhood, but back back when I was in uh, in my 10th standard, I had an opportunity to kind of, uh, you know, do do something for the very first thing, which I have never done. So uh, I was approached. I got a call from someone saying that, you know, there is a show uh, in Mumbai and we are trying to look for someone who can speak on mic. And uh, because of that prompt uh, nature that I had, I said, oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Speaking on mic is not difficult and I definitely want to do that. So because of that promptness, you would not believe I got an opportunity to work with Arbaz Khan. Oh, okay. And I was with him for almost a month going everywhere where he was going for the C8 tire promotion. And I was the mic person who was talking for him. <laughs> oh, oh, that's, that's really great. So to look, we never, I, I think we never met in our life. Am I right? Uh, yeah, we haven't. I had come to your office a couple of times, but uh, I never got an opportunity to meet you in person. But I'm glad I'm able to speak to you now. Oh, that's my pleasure. So have you dealt with SaveMax? I'm not too sure about it. Uh, first of all, I would really want to thank you. Um, you know, thank your entire team for helping me get a new brand new house that I recently moved into. Okay. So I recently did a selling and a purchase uh, with Gurpreet and Asar. Okay. And and I'm really so very happy that, you know, I, I ended up getting a dream house, which, you know, after uh, buying this house, when I'm seeing the neighbor, neighboring houses of the property, they've gone almost 200,000 up wow. within a month. There you go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I'm so happy that, you know, like I and my wife are like super fan of yours. And that my wife is the one who is always, you know, uh, waking me up and saying that, oh, Raman, uh, sir, is live. So do you want to uh, go and check him out? And I was like, oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> and I, I really appreciate the look. And uh, I really want to say thanks to your wife as well. Uh, but just humble request, like, you know, next time, whenever she says Raman, sir, just tell her, no, Raman, sir, only Raman. <laughs> Maybe she is listening to you right now. <laughs> what's, her, what's her name? Rutika. Rutika, oh yeah, Rutika comes too, and she, I know, like last time also. Uh, okay, Rutika, uh, thank you very much, uh, and I, I really appreciate that. And uh, Rutika, I firmly believe, and I, that's what I strongly encourage in my office to everybody. Uh, I know sometimes we have an uh, because there are a lot many people who are a little senior to me in terms of the age, and uh, uh, so I, I humbly request, like you know, let's call each other with our first name. That's always a better culture which we should promote over there uh, see again she's writing sir no Rutika, i am definitely going to <laughs> and 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 raman i just want to uh, quickly uh, thank you for uh, you know for all the motivation that you have been spreading through all your live sessions and honestly because of that uh, i am making like good good salary today and because of all your encouragement we have decided to finally enroll ourselves to the Humber College and we are now opting our uh, real estate program. Um, and um, recently we have like started our first course and I did even reach out to Cable and uh, I, I did inform him that I'm, you know, like super excited to join SaveMax. So that's the reason when I was typing you, that's what I meant that, you know, I, I see myself as the fourth person in the video, but I didn't know that dream is going to come true so early. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, see, the thing is, uh, and uh, uh, I, I really appreciate uh, Tlok. Uh, I always encourage people, like, uh, even when I was not in real estate, you won't believe. I used to push people that, you know what, you should go and buy a house. And uh, they were always asking me, Raman, are you getting some side cut from a realtor? That's why you are pushing us. And my response to that was, guys, I am not telling you to who you should go and buy the house. Yeah. You make your own choice because I was not in real estate at that time. Now, I know I always tell people come and uh, uh, deal with Team Save Max, but of course, like I, I definitely understand. So, uh, to know my simple logic, simple reason at that time, and even today, if your friends, your known people in your surrounding, your family members, your relatives, if they all are successful, if they all have good life, definitely 
it is a it is a moment it is a good happiness for you too exactly i used to tell them like in an in a joke way that if you have a house i have another place to come and eat some, eat the, eat the food right yeah, yeah that's that's so correct <laughs> so i think and that's how we make each other's lives better and uh, you won't believe a majority of the people who are working in savemax they were actually savemax client that's how they come in touch with savemax either you take uh, kamal or you take sachin or anybody so their journey with savemax actually started as a client i was the one who encouraged many of them to come and join real estate profession that's so, and, uh, so every single person in savemax is hand picked and i'm so happy that uh, you are coming and joining this profession uh, but don't come with an impression that it is going to be an easy job no uh, definitely not it yeah. sure is not an easy job for people see honestly i am not doing less hard work today um, i am uh, i i hardly sleep uh, over my work because i know my responsibilities and i am someone who will not get sleep unless i finish off a task at hand um, so i know what potential do i have and thanks for uh you know brushing that up every time in your video calls because it it only adds up to my motivation level and that's the reason uh if kamal if you remember even last week i think we spoke over the phone regarding the entrepreneur um program that you guys are offering um and honestly hearing at the figures i i did mention that you know i have some arrangement but you know i i still lack some of the money that is required to uh, you know put put against uh, uh, a franchisee but when i saw the video title today right i mean zero investment and you know everything that was was working in my favor i thought you you know what i don't want to miss this video at any chance and finally being a part of this is like super amazing for me today <laughs> now i'm happy that uh, you know you are enjoying the show and you are you are joining with us today so uh, look just give me a little bit idea like what exactly you do right now So I am a IT analyst and I am a robotic process automation developer at uh, Bruce Power. So currently we are working from home, but uh, I support all their automation practices uh, and I am more of a technical manager kind of a role in IT. And, and you know what? I think I I need to definitely pick up your brain uh, because this technology always uh, you know uh, is giving me a little bit extra energy. Uh, i'm not a techy guy unfortunately but i love uh, to talk to the people who knows about technology uh, i think this is the future of the world and at save max we are really putting a lot of efforts a lot of uh, resources i would say uh, to bring the latest technology not only for our clients but for our realtors as well uh, recently uh, i think two days before am i right kamal we launched our new website Yeah, I would strongly encourage everybody, whosoever is watching today's show. Uh, we have really put a lot of efforts to bring up uh, something very um, high tech, and again, this is just the first phase which we launched. And uh, so you can see all the listings live over there. Um, it is actually uh, just fifteen minutes update from the MLS, which normally the realtors access. so That's you can uh, you can see the listings live there as a realtor can see just by the delay of 15 minutes and we have given a target to our team that we want to bring that delay just to couple of minutes maybe two or three minutes so mm -hmm. if you want to get any information about any latest listing i would say even before your realtor because sometimes realtors they don't even look at mls <laughs> so you can go and visit www.savemax.ca and very soon we are bringing a very high end very uh, easy to use app uh, for iphone as well as android uh, so we will be hopefully giving you that app within another couple of weeks but till the time you can definitely go and visit www.savemax.ca and that is such an easy to navigate uh on that site that you will first see uh, the latest listing which has come up into the market it is automatically going to detect your location and will start giving you the listing and then when if you if you are looking for any specific house you can just put your details over there and request and our artificial intelligence system will make sure that you are getting up to date information about the similar houses which you like the moment they come into the market 
and uh, to look at another interesting uh, feature which is there on the website and i would strongly recommend you to go and try it you can go and get the value of your house right there without any human intervention you know what raman before you letting me know to do that i already did while we were talking and i would really want to share a honest feedback it's better than zolo because i have been i have been looking up for my uh, you know like addresses and i have been looking up for all the properties uh, uh, prior to our purchase because honestly we don't have access to a mls right so mm -hmm. rather than me reaching out to uh, you know your guys who are super prompt in like all the all the ways but you know sometimes we need that you know like uh, okay what's going on in our area and like i usually go go to zolo but i think uh, this is now the new zolo for me so thanks for sharing that <laughs> Uh, and uh, 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 Tilok, we are really bringing up Sachin. Would you yeah. like to give a little bit uh, uh, insight about the new website? Because uh, Sachin was the one who was leading on that project with Amar, who is our CTO. And I'm so happy uh, right now he is traveling abroad um, just to have uh, do some setup for the company. Uh, and very soon we'll be making an announcement that we are entering into an international market as well very soon. So Sachin, why don't you give a little bit update about uh, about our new website? Sure, Raman. And before I do that, I would like to thank Trilok. You know, he worked with Gurpreet and Asad. They both are my team member. Asad is an amazing guy. And I hope Trilok had an amazing experience working with Gurpreet and Asad. I did. I did. I, it was really fun working with them, honestly. Perfect. Perfect. So as far as the platform is concerned, again, yet I think day before yesterday, only we made this website live. And this is just a phase one of the our platform. Uh, so right now, this is getting updated every approximately 20 to 25 minutes. Uh, so you will have the live access to whatever listings are coming up into the into the MLS system within 20 minutes. And we are going to reduce it to approximately five to seven minutes. So the, the time will get reduced to five minutes from the MLS. So every five minutes, you will have a live feed. And this is just a phase one right now. Uh, right now, you can do the evaluation for the property uh, like instantly you just put the address and you will have get the value approximate value of the property depending upon what is sold in the neighborhood you can get the sold access data also if once you create a login into a system but this is just a phase one this is just a core the engine that we have developed now we are going to work on phase two and the phase two uh, the the user will have option to put an offer on the property right from the website itself they can put an offer they can put in the conditions plus we are integrating this with the chat bot wherein you can get the valuation through a, um, a artificial intelligent uh, chat bot you can get the area information that you know what tell me what is happening in my neighborhood what's selling in the neighborhood this will be integrated with the Alexa and Google Home. So let's say Trilok, you get up in the morning and you want to know what has sold in the neighborhood. Just say, hey, Alexa, send me the listings that has been you know, sold in the neighborhood. And you will automatically receive a notification for that. Wow. This, we are building a capability into this app wherein you just uh, you know, uh, place your phone in front of a house. It will, it will tell you that what is the house address. And it will the app will tell you the valuation for the house. Sachin, you are opening too much secrets. <laughs> oh my goodness! But that is something so amazing because in current market we don't have something uh, you know even matching fifty percent of the capabilities that you are talking about, and uh, that's so cool. That's really very. Cool. This is just the twenty five percent of what I, what we are doing. Yeah, and Sachin, I think uh, uh, right now we still did not plug the complete data over there. So it might be there might be a chance that uh, your property valuation you are not getting it over there. But I would uh, humbly request you guys just wait for another two weeks because we are feeding all the data into the system uh, time to time. And after two weeks, I think we will be covering ninety percent yes. of the properties all across the country. All yes. across the country, we will be covering ninety percent of the property to give you the value right on the website yes, yes. there is a reason why rutika calls save max as the google of real estate <laughs> <laughs> now now i can definitely relate to her statement because she she knows the potential of what you guys are doing and she 
really always you know like tells me you know like all the new ideas that you have come up with because honestly i would have missed i think one or two videos but prutika haven't missed any single one of it and uh, she always updates me of what's going on and she uh, always helps me keep up to date so uh, honestly this is why why she is like a super fan too <laughs> you know, what i can tell you is that we are not only just building a platform we are building a complete ecosystem yes. wherein client can enter as a lead into a system and the whole process from look show looking at the properties from finalizing an offer from mortgage and closing the property and after sales uh, you know uh, service everything wow. will be done from a single platform itself wow yes so wow. we are building a complete ecosystem for that hmm i am impressed and uh, i am just like thinking that i am in the future today <laughs> and sachin once covid is over we are going to invite uh, rutika and uh, uh, trilok for a for a dinner yes definitely oh, wow. <laughs> oh my goodness that's, that's and, and even i am dying to go for a dinner you know <laughs> i i honestly like when i had come to your uh, mississauga office raman i was uh, like you know like wanting to meet you uh, i did speak over uh, uh, you know like with abhishek and nirupam but i couldn't uh, ever speak to you and uh, sachin I, i did get a chance to speak with kamal as well uh, but i'm so like you honestly made my uh, day weeks and months uh, going forward <laughs> i'm so happy and you know uh, it is so good to have you actually you made my day i would say <laughs> oh, wow. thank you raman you know, we all three were getting bored with each other <laughs> See look look how Kamal is looking at us like Kamal is like okay guys let me speak let me do some promotion <laughs> so, sorry guys i didn't really want to hijack the, oh, no, 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 the discussion no, no, no. today but uh, yeah i think i let uh, you know some opportunity for you guys to speak over the topic no no don't you worry about it uh, uh, so Kamal yeah what do you what do you think about the interesting discussion which we are having with Trilok today oh yes of course and i think that once uh, we have a official launch it will be a kind of another game changer uh, you know i can only say that because i have seen the website i have seen the things that are those are getting integrated in the system and the technology what we are looking at uh, i think that's going to be mind boggling it is going to be mind boggling that's that's and i uh, see i think this this should be our endeavor like you know whatever field we are in we need to make sure that uh, uh, client should get always the best and uh, most of the time it happens i have seen uh, businesses they get complacent entrepreneurs never get complacent they are always trying to find out something new right and contributing to your profession contributing to the society contributing to the country where you live is i think is the real meaning of life and we will keep at least personally i promise you i assure you i will keep trying my level best to bring all these things as better as i can to the best of my abilities and understanding um such and you were talking about the entrepreneurship with the like you know very minimal responsibilities and uh, accountabilities in terms of managing the brokerage and all that stuff so i i, I would request you to share a little bit more insight about the same with, with all the viewers because many people they want to know so raman right now we are on initial stage to create that model uh, as i said you know when i was talk, uh, talking to one of the realtor you know he has small team and when i studied the market there is lot of i would say uh, small team that are working they are doing good business but they want to work within themselves but they do not have system to expand that business they do not have system to do the lead generation uh, they do not have that support system wherein somebody can uh, you know work towards creating a marketing support system for them which will help them increase their business now because the team is small the business is not that big wherein they can have a independent uh, uh, marketing resource or independent admin resource so that they can focus on the productivity of their own business and that's where they are they are uh, you know stuck they are not able to uh, grow themselves so we are building a model wherein they can work into a savemax ecosystem 
they can they can uh, grow their team using savemax resources using savemax platform and using savemax assets and their growth can be multifolds and for that they do not have to open a franchise they do not do not have to open an office they can use savemax space itself and by which their, their whole business can grow without making too much of investment or taking too much of liability on their head hmm. so that is basically the framework of that model yeah and sachin i think uh, earlier also we worked a lot on it and i think we are still working by integrating a high end technology into our system yeah. and bringing the cost down so uh, to look i will just share a little numbers with you um so what happened earlier is like even when i was opening the brokerage so i was uh, uh, i was trying to understand the business and i was so discouraged by the by the bigger brands that you know what no 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 if you are even thinking about it uh, first of all you have to have a front desk which is going to cost you $30000 then you need to have a deal secretary or the back office which is going to cost you 40 to $50000 so all together this is an $80000 expense and then you have to have an office which is going to cost you 40 to $50000 so that brings my cost to around 130000 and then at that time i was not uh, a broker so yeah. if you have to hire a broker the cost which is around 50 to 60000 so all together the cost go just to start the business around $200000 and then you have to promote you have to advertise you have to build up infrastructure and then uh, there are certain challenges of uh, uh, adhering to the RICO guidelines, all the rules and regulations and all the stuff. So there's so much to do. And I always had a dream because I personally think entrepreneurship is not anybody's personal property. It, is, it does not come in the inheritance that it belongs to only rich people. It, it belongs to only elite class. And I think it has been proven many times. Uh, I look at look at Elon Musk. I'm reading his book and I'm so impressed. Look at uh, uh, Steve Jobs. Look at uh, Bill Gates. Look at uh, Mark Zuckerberg. All these are very wonderful examples. If all of these people they started their companies. Somebody from basement, somebody from garage, and I always try to correlate because we opened SaveMax in in a basement too, right, Sachin? Yes. <laughs> I still proudly say that. We still proudly say that. Of course, like you know, we we that, that those are the moments, Sachin, which I always uh, uh, enjoy in my life, and I I personally want to say thanks to every single individual. It doesn't matter either they are working with us today or they are not working with us. I wish we all would have been together. But of course, sometimes in life it happens. People have their own plans and all that stuff. Uh, but I still have a, a special place in my heart. To those people who came and joined SaveMax when it started in a basement, and uh, 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 to look, I want to share a very special moment with you. Uh, we had a guy who actually was part of our team when we started basement, uh, when we started SaveMax in a basement. And I remember when, because of one or the other reason, uh, we have to say goodbye to him. I actually cried on that. And I cried in front of him because, and I wish, and Sachin knows about whom I'm talking, I wish he would have been part of our team today and would have enjoyed the success with us. And this is very, very important in our life. Uh, I still remember when we started Basement, Sachin uh, and me, we used to talk. Um, Sachin was the first, uh, I would say, uh, employee or uh, co-founder of Save Max, so we both were working as an employees over there. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, you know, I, I, think I just want to add, add something here. Like there is a reason why you know, like I when you are saying that you know in the initial stages you had someone who helped you like during your initial stages of your life, and uh, honestly, this is the primary reason why our childhood friends are our best friends because in our childhood we don't have money, we have our all our hardships, we are struggling with our education, we are growing in our life. And that's what when those friends who are with us, they are with us for lifelong. And I, I totally believe whether it's business or life, 
people who have helped you in your tough times or, or especially when you're growing are the real ones. So should always stick to them. Absolutely. Absolutely. So um, Sachin, we were talking about this model, uh, which we are actually, which is getting very popular because there are a lot many people who have that entrepreneurial bug. We actually should get a patent of this word. Kamal, can you work on that? <laughs> oh, <yeah>, sure. <laughs> <laughs> that entrepreneurial bug should not be suppressed. It should be given an opportunity to come and explore the possibilities. And this is what our vision, this is what our dream is. So it is my humble request to all those, either they are in real estate industry or if they are not in real estate industry, get in touch with Kamal, sit with him and see how that meeting can actually change the direction of your life. Um, Sachin, I was talking to somebody a couple of days before and uh, he actually made a wonderful statement. He said, Raman, Savemax is inspiring me so much when I'm not part of the system. I am really thinking how much inspiration I'm going to get when I'm part of the system. Same applies with me, Raman. <laughs> okay, that's good. <laughs> anyway, so uh, to look, uh, first of all, thank you very much for uh, joining us today. Uh, we are already uh, uh, close to the time to say goodbye to everybody. It's like a couple of more uh, minutes left. But uh, before that, I want to say thanks to you for uh, uh, jumping onto the show. <laughs> and I think it was more fun. Instant, instant is the other way around. Uh, thank you all for the opportunity to at least, uh, you know, like talk to you in person. Um, I don't care even if my video was off, I still uh, wanted to not to be seen in public, but uh, rather to talk to you guys. And uh, I really thank you for that opportunity. No, no, your video is very well on and everybody <laughs> can see you. <laughs> thank you. What I, what I love about you to look. I can see a beautiful smile out there. And oh, wow. <laughs> thank you, Raman. Thank you so much. Life, um, uh, I, I, I got a very positive feeling from you. I know we never met in our life, but somehow I get like very positive feeling. And I know uh, it is going to be a wonderful association and it is going to be an amazing journey together. And uh, I would love you to be part of Save Max family. And of course, uh, uh, we're going to get a chance to uh, meet uh, uh, such a wonderful couple and uh, we're definitely going to catch up each other on a dinner. I will send you a special invite. And oh <laughs> Even if you don't, Raman, I am I am so happy with the fact that you considered it. So I'm really thankful for, for, for this opportunity. I'm really thankful. Thank you so much. And Rutika, thank you very much for pushing him, for encouraging him. <laughs> she, she's always behind me, so yeah. <laughs> thank you so much. All right, so uh, Kamal, yeah. I will give you I will give you 180 seconds to say whatever you want to say. <laughs> no, first of all, I just wanted to thank uh, you know so many wishes which came in last two days and from uh, in Canada and out of Canada, like say from my home country, and I'm really happy to see like the kind of um, wishes, the blessings, the affection, you know, I and it gives me a very uh, strong feeling of motivation rather, you know that. People whom, whom I have worked 20 years back, especially the people who groomed me, you know, 10, 15 years back, my ex, uh, uh, I won't call them bosses, the, they are the leaders, you know. Oh, I thought you were saying your ex. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I mean, uh, I, I still feel and I you know I still remember like how I was being groomed and really uh, thankful for my heart. And, um, and I still uh, look forward to grow with the company and grow with you, Raman here. And uh, definitely, uh, and the second part is like the way we are growing and uh, as we have our plans for US and we are looking for some uh, uh, resources there. If uh, people who are listening to this, if they know people, then please just recommend me. They are looking for some good um, uh, people to work in US with us. And uh, yeah, definitely in other parts of the country, we will be you know making those announcements in coming forums. Here again, as I said last week when we spoke about like like now almost uh, we have 30 plus uh, franchises coming up. Very few uh, locations because most of the time it happens that people coming from Brampton or nearby, they look for the location in Brampton, but almost all the locations are getting over now. 
and uh, we are expanding to different parts in west and east and we very soon have a, a new team member joining from bc he will be here tomorrow and uh, we would see a lot of uh, traction in bc as well so uh, we look to grow uh, in coming months and it's going to be very exciting you know and my number is 4163338747 i just got a couple of uh, facebook uh, messages yeah i'm just repeating my number 4163338747 and we can definitely discuss more yeah um uh, and kamal uh, not only that we are expanding uh, save max on the realtors and entrepreneurs level we are expanding save max as far as the corporate team is concerned and i'm so happy to see your team is growing right would you like to introduce your team members just like okay. share them, like you know their little introduction so that you know if somebody is trying to contact you i know you are getting a celebrity and sometime i have to take a uh, appointment to meet you come on come on you know me <laughs> should i bring tyler here uh, oh is he here uh, of course here. bring him in bring him oh, in hey tyler. <laughs> hey tyler yeah so sachin um uh, uh, very soon uh, trilok we are looking for uh, uh, a national head or a country head for us and uh, mm -hmm. we would prefer to have somebody who lives in us uh, so that you know we can uh, uh, we can start uh, working up uh, and building up uh, our team in in united states as well and we have already started working on some other countries which mm -hmm. definitely we are going to share information uh, from time to time on indeed and on all of the platforms the job postings are there and also we are looking to expand our corporate team uh, so Kamal has already got somebody for uh, British Columbia. Uh, we are looking for somebody uh, full timer for uh, uh, for Alberta as well as Nova Scotia and uh, uh, PEI and all, all those provinces. So we are actively looking for people who wants to build a career in real estate field, but on the corporate side. So if you know somebody or if there is anybody who feels they can be a part of our, they can be a good association and part of our team. I'll be more than happy to consider the resume. You can send your resume to our HR team and uh, they will definitely plan to coordinate an interview with you. So Thanks, for sure, I can check with my a couple of friends in US and if, I'll see if their interest aligns in the real estate industry. And if the, if, if, if they kind of, I, I feel they're fit for, uh, you know, my recommendation, then definitely I would share it. Excellent. Excellent. So uh, uh, yeah, Tyler is on lunch, uh, Raman, and uh, he wasn't aware, so he's like a little far from our office right away. No problem. So, but yeah, I mean, uh, I can introduce that he's a good, uh, young, charming guy. So he is gonna take the uh, baton, baton ahead, and uh, yeah, we look forward to serve all our team members who are joining us and who are in the queue. Rather, I would say, you know, whom we are meeting and having discussions on. So probably everyone is going to have a fantastic journey ahead. So uh, thank you, Tulok, for joining us for today. I will say uh, it was really a pleasure moment for us to have your smiling face uh, and sharing the screen with you. And I really feel like, uh, you know what? I think you, you made a you made a good day for us. Mutual feelings, mutual feelings, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for the, the opportunity to come and uh, talk to you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Tulok. Have a good day. Bye. Bye, everyone. OK, Tulok, bye. All right, friends. So I know today we have made an instantaneous entry. Uh, all of a sudden, uh, uh, you you might have seen actually Tulok just sent a message online, and I was, uh, you know, I thought it's a good idea. I'll let him uh, be part of us. And Sachin, why not? Like next yes. time, if anybody else wants to become part of uh, our uh, discussion and show, I think it was it it makes it more lively. It makes it more interesting. So we'll be very happy to introduce you here on the platform, guys. And if you want to become part of this profession, either you have real estate license or you don't have real estate license, don't hesitate to get in touch with Kamal Tomer. His number we have already shared. It is on the screen as well, 416-333-8747. Thank you very much. Have an amazing day. See you soon. Next Thanks, week, Raman. sharp yeah. at 12 o'clock with some more interesting discussion. And if you want to become part, please don't send us a message in advance. Let's do something instantaneous. That's the more fun. <laughs> Have a fantastic weekend ahead, guys. Thank you very Thank much. You. Thank, Thank you. Thank you.